Okay, in a minute we're going to go in and take a quick look at the picture on the Magnavox. We seem to have a new problem here. All I did was uh, I took a control cleaner, which is safe for potentiometers and most plastics. I cleaned the top controls, the contrast, the vertical hold, I think the horizontal hold and the brightness. Just very sparingly put a couple drops of the deoxid cleaner in there. I'll show you in a minute. And uh, I don't seem to recall the problem I've had before, although the vertical is what we're, we're into now. It seems to not lock the picture. The vertical lock is terrible. It drifts. It's not locking in. Locks in. I'll show you some samples in a moment. So I don't know quite where to start looking around. Um, the capacitors here and here maybe. Um, this capacitor here, this section of C3 we tested is okay, 100 microfarad. It said, it says over here 15 volts, but I remember getting like 30 out of this. This is like a 50 volt cap. There's 35 over here. You can adjust vertical linearity, vertical hold, uh, vertical size. Uh, nothing, nothing, nothing is the solution. You can adjust all you want, but nothing, uh, nothing cures it. There's your height linearity and vertical hold. Something in here, the old not locking the picture in. Okay, it's a nice day outside. I want to concentrate on the cabinet. Spent a little time today on the cabinet, but uh, here we go. I'm going to turn the set on. And the Almencos here are C56, C66, C67, and C69, which I've only found one so far, a 0.1 at 1,000, a, a 0.01 at 1,600, I'm sorry. So there's our picture coming in over there. The horizontal will lock. Let me get you over there. It'll lock for a moment or so, but uh, and I've been turning the linearity, so everything is is not set right at the moment. But we've lost the ability to lock in the picture. picture will not stay locked. Okay, just quickly, I'm going to read the voltage on that third section of this capacitor here. 18 volts. And Sam says, it. 
Sam says 15 volts, so that's okay. And that cap checks good. So we have something going on in this area over here. Uh, I will check some voltages. I don't think it's a voltage type problem. Check the input of the 6BF6. The 6BF6 is pin 1. Pin 1 is the input grid. Okay, it says G1 right here, I believe. 37 volts. Sim says minus 40. Okay, I have minus 37. Okay, minus 40. I'll check the plate pin 7. Pin 7 is 48 volts. Pin 7 is 48. It says 50, so that's right on. So. We don't have a tube to swap these out with. I know there's a 6GH8 here, the sync phase inverter, and AGC keying in the... Uh... So the BF6 tests okay. The screen doesn't have a screen. Zero volts on 5 and 6. Yeah, point seven. Okay, that's it for now.